Hello everyone and welcome back to Forza Horizon 4 and we're going to be back over here in the 2015 Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. Holy crap, this freaking thing is looking so like, uh, it's looking so freaking legendary again, you know what I mean? We haven't used the thing in like over a year. The last time we actually used the Dodge Charger was back in 2020 when we actually had to go into quarantine with the Coronas and everything. It was all in red but now it's all in blue because this is like one of the cool colors of what the car is supposed to be looking like. Gonna be back over here in the Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. You already know it's gonna be the Hellcat Cat Pack because obviously whenever it comes to me driving this thing, we're gonna be going nitro speed with nitro injection and everything like that, you know what I mean? Gonna be going hard in the paint. And of course the interior looks exactly the same from last year, you know what I mean? Like nothing, like nothing here, nothing inside this car has changed at all, you know what I mean? The interior is still the same and everything like that. The gauge is still the same, the freaking uh, the whole speed gauge is still the same. Let's test that real quick. It's still the same, guys. So if anything, we can just like keep it like that and make sure that this car is still steady and stuff like that. We're gonna go ahead and go see what our first race is for today. But first, we're gonna turn off uh, streamer mode or turn it on, I believe. Oh my god, I keep on saying turn it off, and it's literally off right now. Like, what am I talking about? I don't know what's going on in my head today. If I go off the rails again, I apologize for that, guys, because I'm like. Like, I just had a stressful day today, but hopefully this game, hopefully everything in this game will make it even easier for today. We're going to go ahead and go for our first race and go to go over there and complete the whole thing. We're going to be doing nighttime too, by the way, guys. So if anything, we're going to keep it, like, basically a level, a level type car, you know what I mean? Because nothing about this is, like, way much, like, harder because this car has, like, has good significance. God dang it, bro. Come on now. Freaking wrecked my car already, bro. Are you freaking kidding me? Unbelievable. Freaking AI trying to wreck me over and I keep saying freaking all the time. Like, come on now, bro. It's freaking stupid. Alright then, well, whatever. We're gonna go ahead and go to the race down at the Elms Dawn on Sea Sprint because it's like way much easier just to race in that type of race. We've actually done that plenty of times before, but I'm gonna plan on doing something different for today if it actually lets me do this this time because I haven't actually... I haven't like planned and see if I do it off of the offline mode because whenever I try to do it offline and stuff like that, when I have it like that, I don't know how it's gonna be, but whenever I'm online, it sticks to doing it that way. But we'll see how it goes whenever I'm trying to do it offline. If it doesn't let me do it offline, then we're gonna go ahead and do the Elms on C Sprint, the real race, because I have some other creating races just for a spoiler surprise, which is way much easier just to keep it on the lowdown to be able to keep everything straight and make sure that the races that I've been doing is, is like not mixed up and everything because I actually have a few names myself to be able to not make it the same name as uh, Elves Dawn on Sea Sprint. You know what I mean? We have different names for the races and everything. That's how it is and that's how I did that. You know what I mean? I did it over the weekend too, by the way, I believe. I don't know. I believe it was over the weekend. It was like a few days ago, but we'll see. We're going to keep going here to this little road over here and of course we're over here at the race for today let's get this on right now hopefully this works guys okay so i was gonna do like the other different races that actually tried to include this one but it told me i had to like use a different car because i like basically had the settings like that two years ago i don't know what i was thinking back then but you know it is it is what it is but whatever let's look at this whole thing on right now and i'm just on c sprint all right, then, here we go. Gonna be starting in three, two, one, go! All right, then, here we are. We got It's Humphrey here. I don't know who Humphrey is. I know a dude whose last name is Humphrey, but I forgot what his whole name was. But whatever. We're gonna go ahead and just, like, stick to what we're doing right now and make sure we take it steady this time. We're on. Anybody got time for your bullcrap today? Just, like, take it like take it steady. I almost said my own name right there for some reason, but just, like, take it steady, bro. Gonna be slowing down. You know, we're over here in the 2015... Dodge Charger Hellcat Cat Pack because holy crap, it's like one of the most coolest cars ever in history, dude. We have not used this car in a long time, even though it's been over a year or two. We've actually used like two different cars for two different seasons. For winter, it was the Snow Cat. For like spring, it was the freaking, what do you call it again? It was the um, red car. It was like a regular Hellcat. And this one is just the Hellcat Cat Pack for summer. We'll see what we're going to be doing for the fall one. We'll actually try to complete that. But if we don't actually get a chance to do that, then basically, you know, it's just like, we'll see, guys. We'll just see. You know what I mean? I'll make sure that this car gets its own seasonal type of pack for 
you know, you know the uh, fall pack, you know what I mean? Like whenever fall comes in that type of day, we'll see how it goes. It might be the beginning of the whole entire fall season when I get this car, you know what I mean? Just paint a different color. I may make it orange, just make it like a fall type related, um, you know, season car, you know what I mean? Just to make it easier for us and not go over the edge. Alright, so we're over here in first person, gonna be getting some more points over here at 14k, you know, 14 a thousand k. Like, my god, I'm over here getting like so many like drifting points and everything, like drafting, drifting points. Either way, I'm still getting those points, guys. Like, my god, I'm over here getting clean racing, slingshot. Holy crap, I cannot fail. I cannot fail, bro. I got 67,000. Holy crap, that is so good. So that means I got like over like uh, more than two, more than two, uh, skill perks right there because my god I was freaking legendary right there you know what I mean that was like way too much awesome skill chain that's right 708 points for that you know what I mean for the uh global influence right there you know what I mean just to go to the influence board I'm over here in second place right now and the guy who was in first place I don't know what his name is I'm trying to see I don't know what his name is but we'll see if we actually try to get down there because I have because I don't have my glasses on right now so if you guys don't mind if you guys don't know, like, if you guys don't mind, I don't like, don't like being made fun of whenever I have my glasses on and everything. I'm still doing good right now, but like, I need my glasses to be able to see clearly of the name because I can't like see that well. It's way much easier just to like keep the glasses on to be able to read the names. I, like, I can still read the uh, points of when I'm trying to get my drift tap and everything like that on still. This is a one lap race, so if anything, we're like failing right now. And I lost like, you know, my freaking side mirror from the right side, god dang it. The finish line went over there, I failed, fifth place, it's not that bad, but you know, it is what it is, guys. So fifth place, I'm gonna go ahead and go finish and be done with this for today. It was not a good choice, but hey, I, like, at least I did it, you know what I mean? At least I did it, you know? Fifth place, I'll take it, you know what I mean? Plus, I heard whenever I, like, get into the last place, I, like, whenever I get to the last places, I get, like, a whole lot of credits, and that's, like, easier just to keep the whole thing going, you know what I mean? You know, you know what they say, guys. Whenever I keep going for the last place or whatever, if it's not like in fourth place, I get like more credits than they do. So if anything, still, yeah, it is what it is. All right then, so I got like over 8,000 credits. See, like, like, you know what I mean, guys? You know, whenever I'm like doing races and it's not like me getting to either first through fourth place, still better. And I'm on level six, nine now, of course, six, nine. A good trolling number. Gotta love it. Alright then, we're over here gonna be getting the wheel spin on. So what is my prize for today? It is gonna be a new car! And it's gonna be the old school Chevrolet, which I was supposed to be expecting anyway, so that's good to know. Oh my god, it's raining outside now. God dang it. Well, if you guys hear rain in the background, I apologize for that. We're gonna go do one more race and be done with this for today. Let's go ahead and see where we're gonna be going to. I'm gonna go ahead and go to the middle sprint because that's like way much uh way much easier just to get that race done you know what i mean over here in the nighttime gonna be drifting hitting stuff like this because this car has no good handling you know what i mean the design and the exterior and the exterior is still good but like it's just like you know what they say guys you know what i mean whenever like the good cars have no good handling and the bad cars have good handling it's just the opposites you know what i mean the opposites have like no good integrity and i kind of hate that you know what i mean it has to be equal when it's a good car it's supposed to have a good handling but nope it's a good car with bad handling i kind of hate that you know what i mean i just hate the way it does that for some type of reason and it just like it was just built like this when i first got it by the way so if anything i got this car back in 2018 so if you guys actually knew by now you guys saw my videos before but i actually got this car off camera so it was just like me buying it anyway, so you know, it's just like whenever I try to keep things on the lowdown, me gonna be going over to the race and getting this last race on, hitting that guy because I suck at driving, I'm not gonna be behind because it's way much easier just to like not pay attention to the front side. You know, the front side is way much the harder side, gonna be going off the rails again, you know what I mean? This could be used as a, um, an off-road vehicle as well, but an off-road Charger sedan, but whatever. For our last race for today, it's gonna be over here at the middle sprint. Let's go get this on right now, guys. Let's do this. All right, then here we go for our last race. Uh, last race. Our last race for today. You gotta be kidding me, bro. Freaking round size like distracted me, and of course you guys hear it in the background. So yeah, it's not gonna be nighttime for this race. Let's go get this on right now. Nice holding, by the way. 
Alright then, ready, set, go! Alright then, well, finally. It's been a long goddamn time for me to even get this whole thing loaded, so... I got fifth place in the first race, so if you guys don't actually mind, I'm trying to get, like, first place, so... Like, scoot over, please, you know what I mean? I'm trying to, like, get to first place just to be able to get that home Nobel Prize, you know what I mean? It's way much easier just to, like, stick to the whole entire platform here on YouTube. It's still a good platform. Well, I want to say good or bad, but it's, like, equal. So, if anything, it's not like what it used to be anymore. It's just, like, way much easier just to, like, keep things slow and just make sure that, like, none of this whole thing just, like, keeps the whole entire platform from going downhill because YouTube is, like, one of the closest platforms in the whole entire world, like, especially throughout, like, other countries, so, like, you know what I mean? Alright, still gonna be keeping this whole thing clear, gonna be getting in first place, gonna be turning to right, god dang it, that was a bad timing right there. You know, this freaking handling sucks butt, though, you know what I mean? It's like me after using the brakes instead of, like, the, um, the A brake, because the A brakes, like, makes it way much harder for us to even get in first place. But me speeding on through and using the brakes with the whole entire handbrake one is way much easier instead of the, like, the, um, what do you call it again? The, like, well, I'm not sure if it's actually, like, the handbrake per se, but, like, the foot brake. Yeah, the foot brake's much easier just to, like, slow it down and just go from there, but you know how it is, guys. You already know how it is. Gonna keep blazing on through to the location. That was a close one. Trying to go on to the finishing line, which is the same destination location, whatever. Stop here, go there, and we're all good. I'm in first place now, so awesome, clean racing. That's all I can see right there. Keeping this whole thing steady, just for the heck of it, you know? Gonna be blazing on through with this whole blue Hellcat cat pack, you know what I mean? The scat pack is way much easier just to like keep the whole car in a nitro position. It, it, like, it's basically unless the whole entire car goes off the freaking ledge. And I lost all my points right there for some goddamn reason, you know what I mean? Still gonna keep blazing on through, doing good right now. You know, gonna be drifting, gonna be tapping with the drift tap. There you go. There you go! See the drift tap back there? That was awesome. You see, I got over a thousand points. And the finishing line is right over here! We're done for today! Exactly! The Hellcat Cat Pack never fails. Of course, it's easy just to, like, keep the whole thing going because we, like, still have, like, a good integrity for, like, every racer here in this game. You know, every single racer has done good for today. This video is going to be short for today, which I don't care about. And, of course, for me, I got first place. We got the Holden, and we got the Ford Shelby, I think. It's, like, a different type of grill, by the way, so... Don't call me out in the comments if I'm actually wrong, guys. Got over 2.7 million credits still, you know what I mean? That's all I gotta say right there. And I got 3,000 credits. Nice. Alright then, so that's gonna go ahead and do for this video for today. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. And let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below what you thought about this car. If you want, like, if you guys want me to use it again, then let me know because, you know... Obviously, this car is, like, so freaking legendary, you know what I mean? It's so unique. It's so, like, elegant and everything. This car has, like... A whole lot much because Dodge is actually my um Dodge is my favorite brand and everything and because I like the the, uh, the uh, Dodge Durango and the Dodge Dart and all that stuff the Dodge Viper everything that's like this related to the whole entire Dodge industry is way much easier this way doing a whole burnout with a D right there doing the letter D of course the freaking Cadillac will cut me off for no reason that's gonna go ahead and do for today and I'll see you guys next time take care.